like another damned riddle to me. Thought you were in a hurry. Inscription here. Show me. Can you translate the inscription? I can decipher maybe a third, but that third doesn't make much sense. Give me a minute. I was never any good at the high variant of the Elder Speech. Hmm. All right. This might seem a bit literal. I'm afraid I can't replicate its sophisticated internal rhymes. Just translate it to make sense. Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first to light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, by the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet, like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like a riddle, all right. Alright, let's see if we can solve this. What was that inscription again? Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. First, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. What was that inscription again? Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. Wait, something just happened. Mm -hmm. Behind that wall, a movement. What was that inscription again? Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. It. What do you think? No inscription, sadly. Hmm. Sign of the gull. If I didn't already know where she was buried, I'd guess this is Laura Doran's sepulchre. Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. Heroine of a tragic legend to some, but... Most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Kragenin of Laud. Perhaps the elven mage is Lara's kin. It would explain why he's helping Siri. Possible. This what you're looking for? Uh-huh. So what's it supposed to do? Hmm. I hope I'll be able to activate it. Let's leave this place, shall we? 